welcome class to your daily word lesson and session. Class is in sesh. This is word sesh. And we'll start off with our sesh. Okay. Today's word is sanguine. Sanguine. S A N G U I N E. It's an adjective and it means cheerful, positive, and hoping for good things. They are less sanguine about the prospects for peace. Sanguine can also mean red in color. The sun lit up her hair, bringing out tremendous sanguine red and amber highlights. Positive and hopeful. Usually this is used in face of a dire or a bad situation when someone is hopeful regardless. Some people expect the economy to continue to improve, but others are less sanguine. Blood red, consisting of or relating to blood. Bloodthirsty, accompanied by involving or relating to bloodshed. Of the complexion, ruddy, red in the face. Also in medieval times in medicine, someone who is sanguine was both red and ruddy in the face and also high in spirits. It was both those definitions combined. For some reason, I guess they used to think there was a connection between the two things. I have a theory that maybe just people were drinking and then they turn red because you turn red when you drink and they were just in a cheery mood because of that. There's so many definitions for this word and yet it's not used today really at all. Having blood as the predominating bodily humor. An abundance of red blood was marked by a warm and sanguine temperament whereas an excess of yellow bile produced the choleric temperament back when they used to not know anything about the human body. Also, it could mean having the bodily conformation and temperament held characteristic of such predominance and marked by sturdiness, healthy red complexion, and cheerfulness. For some reason, they linked those two things, a red complexion and cheerfulness. I'm telling you, it's probably the alcohol. And now sanguine as a noun, a moderate to strong red. It's a color. Sanguinely, sanguineness, sanguinity as adjectives. Synonyms for adjective form would be bloodthirsty, bloody, blood-minded, bloody-minded, sorry, homicidal, murdering, murderous. This is one of my favorite words, actually. It doesn't really sound like it relates to blood. It's just, it can be used in so many ways. Sangfroid is a word that it is related to, meaning self-possession, especially under strain. It was also a heraldic term from like medieval times in blazoning, which was the process of like making coat of arms and shields and stuff and putting the colors like the, the, the you know, the line head or whatever their logo was. And that's interesting. It can also refer to a deep red brown crayon or pencil containing iron oxide and its usage greatly dropped off over time. It can also refer to a blood red stain used in the blazoning, like I said. The first time I heard it was in Oblivion 3 when you do the Dark Brotherhood quests. Okay. 
Class is dismissed. You may go. You have my permission to leave now. You couldn't before. Okay. Good night. Morning. Whatever. Thank you.